Welcome back guys to another video. Just had a bit of a break, but I've got some new parts to install. So I'll show you what I've got to put in. I've got a Momo steering wheel, and hub, boss adapter, got a type R shift knob, and also some front and rear floor mats to replace the crusty grey ones. So we're going to get this old steering wheel off and change the old shift knob and the floor mats. So probably start with the steering wheel first. So you just need to disconnect the battery so the horn doesn't make noise and we'll get that out. So you just need to get a flathead screwdriver underneath there and pry it out. On the corner there's a little spot so the carpet will pop out and then inside now you can see the nut that we need to undo. Just going to use the impact with a 19 mil. Just put the nut back on a couple of threads. Make sure the steering wheel is centered. And then there, pull it. Take the last threads off. And steering wheel is removed. So this is what it should look like. Uh, with the steering wheel removed. So next I'll go get the BOSS adapter. So now I've got the adapter here. So it has a marking that says top. So we're just going to align that at the in, in the center line. Just with that tang um, at the bottom and the top. Now you've got that centered, I'm just going to put the nut back on. Centered. Now we'll go look at the steering wheel. So next I've just installed this ring here. That will allow us, after we put our steering wheel in, to hold the horn button. So next we're ready to put the steering wheel on. So you just need to line up the set and have your Allen head bolts as well. Next came with the kit are these two adapter harnesses. So there's a, a female to female and a male to female. So with this hub it's come with a female connector and my horn is a male. So I'm going to use the male to female adapter. in now and connected. I did have to bend the metal finger in there to 
to bend this little metal tang here to locate on this shield. So when the steering wheel turns out, it stays in contact. Next, replacing the shift knob. So just unscrew that. And new shift knob. I already have a, a short shifter in here. The other one felt a bit weird. So this one is much better. Final thing is to replace the floor mats. Floor mats in. The black really looks contrast with this grey. I'm not sure how much I like it. Thinking I might dye this carpet black in a future episode. But happy with the new steering wheel and the shift knob. Alright, that wraps up another video install the steering wheel and the shift knob I'm pretty happy with how it's turned out like comment subscribe stay tuned for the next video i got some more interior upgrades to go and these seats are finally gonna go we're gonna get something better so look forward to that see ya